KHSD News. I'm Erin Briscoe Clark. This week we are in Lion Country, Miramonte High School. It's a school filled with pride and positive messages being served up in the cafeteria. Be brave. It says be you. I'm probably going to go with uh, <laughs> have a good day and remember to smile. The link crew at Miramonte put on their smiles, grabbed some markers, and got to work. They're making uh, positive notes on lunch trays. An idea cooked up by the cafeteria staff. I think I just wanted to spread a positive message. A lot of the kids come to school and you really don't know what's going on at home or even what's going on at school. And just to have something positive, you hear so much negative, so the positive, I think, would be, you know, spread some cheer. And cheer was spread. Students ate up all of the lunchtime love. The lunch ladies were so awesome. Made me feel welcome. It reinforces uh, some of the positive uh, expectations that we've been teaching with kids in the classroom and so to have it come from the cafeteria and the cafeteria staff I think it I think it's really meaningful great job and keep spreading that positivity it was a homecoming 52 years in the making Bakersfield High School students gave a patriotic honor to BHS alum and Navy veteran Jim Mills Mills a Navy aviator went missing after his plane went down over Vietnam his remains were just positively identified once a driller, always a driller. Now let's head out to Stockdale High School. It's a homecoming week for the Mustangs. Leadership students are busy putting the final touches on tonight's festivities when Stockdale takes on independence. That's going to do it for this week's KHST News. Don't forget to follow us on Twitter and check out our website, kernhigh.org. I'm Aaron Briscoe-Clark. See you next week.